When I pooped, you wanna know what came out of my butt? I be family truly flow, flow ready set go, wavy like show, dropping new bits and collecting a dough. Keep it a hundred, you already know. We never frontin' but stuntin' for show from JD to PJ. We keepin' y'all hook like replay. Let's see Ray, deliver the goods, no delay. Y'all too busy cuffin' we <clears throat> What's up everybody? This is the Temecula House fifteen dollar billion. Fifteen dollar billion podcast. Mm -hmm. Um I'm not even gonna ask uh what day it is, what time it is, cause um it's vacation time. It's vacation time. When you're on vacation, yeah. you don't you don't look at time or date. You don't, don't need a focus, ever. Ever. When it's vacation on quarantine. <clears throat> mm-hmm. You need to forget about everything and just focus on what's right in front of you, and that is a pool, um, a pool table. Mm -hmm. But I'm not a rapper, um, and yeah, just let's get started with um our first day here. How was your first day, Judy? My first day was good. It was relaxing. Uh, what did we even do? We went to find parks and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, because we came here around like four o'clock. Well, first, first of all, we came here a little too early. We weren't supposed to check until four o'clock for the people who clean this house. Mm -hmm. So we get here around like two thirty. Yeah, we got here early. Oh yeah. Well, me. We drove separately uh, from our parents because we wanted to scope, scope out the place for any blitz ball fields. Mm. And so we were driving through, looking at like all these crazy houses because Temecula has some crazy ranch houses. Unbelievable. So we were driving around and then my dad pulls up to the house and he's like, hey guys, just come early. Maybe we can get in early. So we come in here and then the people were a little late. So we, we were in here chilling and then the people who cleaned the house like kicked us out. So... We were here a little early, but it wasn't like to start the day. Well, yeah, what did we do? We, after that, we <clears> drove <throat> around. Um, well, we went to Carl's Jr. We did you go guys, Carl's Jr., yes. You guys went to Carl's Jr., mm -hmm. um, grabbed a little bit, chilled out, came up here. We were just like surprised at how crazy the house was. Like, this is a dream house for anybody that comes through here. Like, you literally pull up to what? A hundred plus lemon trees. Oh, yeah. Big, long, like, it's not even a driveway, it's a road. Yeah. To get to this house. Mm -hmm. And then, um, you pull up to the to the house and, like, it's just, it's such a welcoming feeling. Like, mm -hmm. this is what you want. This is where you want to be. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And, um, I don't know, we were just excited. We've been soaking it up. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I look like a burnt nugget, um, right now. And, uh. Yeah, tell me in the comments if I look like a burnt nugget, but anyways, um, <clears throat> how did you guys sleep? Bad. Terrible? Yeah. I slept good. Okay. Very good. Your first day? First day, yeah. But yeah. it's weird though, like, I know Jay said this today, whenever I'm at, like, the house back in, in Torrance, if I wake up in the, like, like 7 o'clock in the morning and I go back to bed, I woke up, like, at 12. Here, I woke up at, like, 7 the first night, mm -hmm. and I closed my eyes, and I woke up, like, 8. Yeah. But it seems like you're sleeping for forever. It's weird. Like, time moves slowly out here. Call me crazy, dude. I really wish that... Or, I was, like, going into this house, seeing how big it was. I was like, dude, I hope this place is haunted. Oh, I, I hope know. we see something. Because we're super into ghosts. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> do you miss your bed, JD? Yeah. A lot? I do. Really? Yeah. Do you, like, what do you miss about it? Is it your pillow? Is it Was it the mattress that was so bad? Yeah, it's the pillows. The pillows? Yeah. It's the smell. I like a certain, uh, elasticity, for lack of a better word, when mm -hmm. it comes to pillows. These pillows just don't have it. Great house, pillows don't have it. Mm -hmm. I don't know, the internet connection is, um, gruesome. But that's that's not what we're here for. Like we weren't here. We knew we weren't here to like play video games. So like we we just like been trying to soak it all in, and then we're gonna have time to play video games. You know? Yeah, but I mean, <laughs> you always need that daily dose. At listen, night. man, we live we live in a society where like Wi-Fi is kind of an essential thing. Yeah, and this it's bad. Like we can't even watch YouTube. Like we can't even watch Twitch. We're trying to watch Doctor, Doctor Disrespect, and it's like buffing everyone, buffering everyone second. <laughs> But then the ads run smoothly, which makes no sense. Yeah. God. Um, with your stay here, <clears throat> well, I have two questions for the both of you guys. With your stay here, 
rate it from 1 to 10, and why? And would you come back to Temecula in this house or another house? Okay, you can answer that first. Nine, yes, and yes. Okay. Yeah, I would give it a nine, and based on the houses that we saw, okay, don't get me wrong, I would love to come back here again, but i also love to see what other houses provide. You know what I'm saying? Why are you shaking your head? Spoiled. <laughs> yeah, oh, my bed is no <laughs> Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah. I need my bed. <clears throat> it would have been it would have been better with a chicken in it, right? <sighs> That's no for comment. certain. For certain. <laughs> for certain. Okay. I mean I I should have brought the Harriet Wig, I could have snuggled up with you. <laughs> oh my gosh. Dude, so yesterday was it yesterday at night we were playing this game? Oh, first night. It was the first night. First night? Because last night we went out to find haunted places. Yeah, the days are going by quick. Like, yeah. I don't want to end. But, so, this game is called Cards Against Humanity. I've never played this game in my life, but me, JD, and Colton were, like, playing till like, 1 in the morning. Literally, like, it was hilarious. And we were like, yo, we have to do it in the podcast. Like, this is, like, we have to share our experience with you guys, you know? Like... It's just, I didn't know the concept of it at first. If you know me, you know how weird I am. And, like, I can literally confuse you whenever I wanted to. And the fact that it's at the same place over the amount of the same time. Mm -hmm. When me and you come together, like, things click together in a certain way of colors, you know? Exactly. There you did. Absolutely. All right? Okay. Back Back to the game, though. Um, somebody's listening to this like, where, where is he? Where is he at? <laughs> um, but back to the game. Uh, this is a ten out of ten game. Like this is really funny, and uh, we wanted to share it with you guys. So we're gonna do a little bit of that. Do you guys have anything to add? Like, okay, yeah, I have a couple things to add. Okay, if you guys don't know what this game is, maybe in high school if you played it, uh, it's it, like on the phone. It was called Evil Apples. If you're a kid. Uh, this is basically apples to apples, but more adult. And I'm going to do a, a warning. The box says 17 and up. So if you're younger than that, I'm warning you now yeah. that this is, this is, it could get offensive. We're going to try to edit out the, the bad ones. We're not trying to offend anybody. It's a game. Yeah. We're not trying to like, you know, make fun of anyone or because there is some religious stuff in here. We're probably going to edit those out. Yeah. But we're not trying to offend anybody. This is just for this fun. This for jokes. Yeah. yeah. So if this offends you or if this could be a little too inappropriate, don't watch. What, what boys? This could be our last video ever. No. No, 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 no. no. This, this, is, this is fun. We're going to get canceled. But I don't care. Let's do no it. No way. We won't. No. Because you guys works. are rocking with us. Yeah. You guys want this. I know you guys want, I, I know <laughs> you guys want this. Anyway. Okay. You want, actually, before we start, you want to explain how it yeah, goes? Yeah, explain the rules a little yeah. bit. There is a pile of, we'll call them black cards, okay, the color. Seriously? So, we, yeah, that's why I said the color. Um, someone's going to grab one, and that person will be the judge. Now, let's say, okay, I'll just pick one out of here, just for an example. Okay. So, this one said, in Michael Jackson's final moments, he thought about blank. <coughs> now, the blank is up to the two other people... Let's just pick a card from our deck right now. Okay. So and this is how. It, this so is the people who aren't judges can hold up to four cards, right? So you pick four cards out of the thing and pick out those. No, four. no, pick the top one. Oh, top We're one. We're just okay. gonna pick okay. the top okay. one. But right. we do have a choice. But yeah. this is the top this, one this from, is the, the from our deck. Tutorial round. Yeah. So read so, it again. In Michael Jackson's final moments, he thought about blank. I'll just take both of your cards. <clears throat> I, I, I won't really know whose is whose. So. In Michael Jackson's final moments, he thought about the glass ceiling. That's an option. Mm-hmm. Or he thought about Gandhi. Okay. Now, since I'm the judge, I have to pick the funniest or the most fitting fitting yeah. answer. And I think I'm going to pick Gandhi. Whose was that? That was mine. Yeah. That was Colton. So he would get that point. But we're okay. not playing for points. We're just, we're just sending it. So um, that's how it is. Are you guys ready? Let's do it. Yeah, let's go. Who would like to be first judge? Me. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah, you're... Yeah. So here is the topic slash question. This isn't even a question. And I would have gotten away with it, too, if it hadn't been for blank. 
Mm -hmm. See what the boys are cooking up. Okay. Okay. And we're switching up here. Don't really know who's who's. So, and I wouldn't have got away with it too if it hadn't been for Michelle Obama's arms, <laughs> or Barack Obama. <laughs> so we got right to that two answers that just fit. Oh my gosh! What are the odds? The odds? I mean, you pick Obamas. And I wouldn't have got, and I wouldn't have gotten away with it too if it hadn't been for Michelle Obama's arms. Or if it hadn't been for Barack Obama. I think Michelle Obama's arms, because that's just Whoa. random and it's funny. Oh my gosh. That was me. That was you. Yeah, okay, right. listen up. Who was president, though? That's the thing. Who was president? Hey, it's just pick the fitting answer on. Yeah. Okay, so do you want to go like a little roto, like this way, that way, or that way? This you can go. You can go. Yeah. These are the cards? Yes. Yeah, these are the cards. Those are the cards. <clears throat> Maybe she's born with it. Maybe it's blank. blank. And I'm gonna get real into this, okay? So, where was listening with headphones? Mm -hmm. Pure. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me know. I'm gonna just um, switch these it up. Are, these are bad. Want. They're not that funny, but whatever. <sighs> okay. Um. Maybe she's born with it. Maybe it's Arnold Schwarzenegger. Maybe she's born with it. Maybe it's a robust mongoloid. <laughs> what the heck is a robust mongoloid? Wait, mongoloid. Wait, 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 wait. Does it count? Like, if I have to ask you? Because then I would, no. like, try to make it make sense, or I just need to know. It doesn't, it doesn't a matter. mongoloid is someone from Mongolia. I, th I heard that mong mongoloids are dumb. People use it as like. Okay. Oh, well, you're a mongoloid. She she's probably a mongoloid. So she's probably a mongoloid. <laughs> All right. All right. Cool. Judge Colton, here we go. <laughs> wow. What's my secret power? <laughs> oh man, I got a good one, dude. <laughs> okay. wait, 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 wait. Let's me and JD go in there. Okay. And then JD gets to see. I'll switch it. <clears throat> Oh, you're gonna love this one. I was gonna do this. <laughs> oh my god. What's my. Oh my gosh. <laughs> What's my secret power? Civilian casualties. <laughs> What's my secret power? The female orgasm. <laughs> I'm female. You know you gotta go female. That's my you secret have power. To. You have to. I mean, I'm single. <sighs> Maybe that's not right. Wow, so, these are good right now. We're doing good. Yeah. Here's next, man. <clears throat> but before I kill you, Mr. Bond, I must show you blank. Oh man, this is rough. And I don't know if you're gonna go with this one, but this is rough. Yeah. I'm gonna switch those again, up. we might edit out some of these in case it gets too crazy. Wait, say read it again. But before I kill you, Mr. Bond, I must show you blank. Oh, I have to do this one. This one's surprising. Yeah, so this one's surprising, dude. I got one that's rough. Got yeah, rough. Is rough. But before I kill you, Mr. Bond, I must show you Asians who aren't good at math. <laughs> that would be a sight to see. <laughs> but before I kill you, Mr. Bond, I must show you bees. I'm gonna have to go with Asians who are the best. Dude, it's good to win, man. Come good. on now, son. <laughs> Dude, you, you Asians are just <laughs> smart, so. It's hard, to see. it's hard to see that, dude. Okay. <clears throat> it's me. It's hard to see it. Oh, don't, don't, don't do that. I didn't do that. You did that. <laughs> okay. During his childhood, Salvador Dali produced hundreds of paintings of. Wow, JD's got a good one for this. I don't know if he's going to test me, though. <clears throat> during, during his childhood, Salvador Dali produced hundreds of paintings of... Yep. Oh, man. Here we go. During his childhood... Childhood? <laughs> during his childhood, Salvador Dali produced hundreds of paintings... Of 
The middle-aged man on roller skates. That's good. That's a JD type answer, roller skates. Yeah. <clears throat> During his childhood, Salvador Dali produced hundreds of paintings of firing a rifle into the air while balls deep in a squealing hog. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go balls deep. Dude, uh, this is rough. <laughs> no one's picked my answer yet. Well, That's the thing. I have such a bad deck. I yeah. might need to get my a bad deck pause. <laughs> I think I have a good deck. <laughs> Speaking about decks, what what gets better with age? <laughs> <laughs> what gets better with age? <laughs> okay. What gets better with age, you might ask? <laughs> you have to say it! Because, Jake, I want you to laugh. I saw it. <laughs> I saw it. Dude. And... Am I saying it? I mean, to go ahead, but... Like, is there the age? <laughs> we might have to cut this. I'll leave it. Oh. Oh, man. Okay. We'll let them, we'll let them, uh, live, 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 read it. Yeah, we'll let them. <laughs> Just you. What gets better with age, you might ask? Switching to Geico. <laughs> man. Um, man. I'm going to have to go with the big pause. <laughs> I'm going to have to. That one's probably the funniest. That was good. Man, I... You know me. I normally <coughs> don't. I don't really have a filter for this kind of thing. And if, mm -hmm. if I pause, it's a bad one. No, no, no. That was rough. Is so, it you? MTV's new reality show features eight washed-up celebrities living with... Blank. I'm getting the rough ones, dude. Don't at me. MTV's new reality show features eight washed up celebrities living with penis envy. <laughs> MTV's new reality show features eight washed up celebrities living with. Oh, yeah. Are you gonna... We're gonna bleep that one. We're gonna yeah, that one out. We're gonna I... blur it out. I'm just gonna pick a new one. Okay, yeah, pick a new one. New topic? When the United States raced the Soviet Union to the moon, the Mexican government fun funneled millions of pesos into research on... Oh, oh. look how quick. <laughs> okay, that was a long question. I'm just going to... Uh, the Mexican government funneled millions of pesos into research on pictures of boobs. <laughs> or... Oh my gosh! Uh, I'm gonna have to pick boobs. Dude, wow. are you kidding me, bro? Yes. Are yes. you kidding me? <laughs> wow, dude. This is a family game. White people in the <laughs> same Two and two. <clears throat> okay, here we go. War! <laughs> what is good for? <laughs> <clears throat> I'm gonna sing it the exact same way so everybody at home. <clears throat> We're gonna go there then. Huh, we're gonna go there, dude. War. What is it good for an erection that lasts longer than four hours? <laughs> <laughs> Call your doctor. Okay. War. What is it good for dick fingers? <laughs> Those are really good, dude, but I'm gonna have to go with four hour erection. Let's go! Oh, number one! JD, man, you came in solid, bro. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm not saying that. Yeah. Pause. Pause. Fingers. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, it's getting really hot. Right? Yeah. What's, what's that smell? Oh my god, I got it. What is that smell? Oh, blank cards. I love the sound of the card. <laughs> What's that smell? Nickel. <laughs> What's that smell? Nickelback. <laughs> What's that smell? My machete. <laughs> I'm gonna 
I'm gonna go Nickelback. Yeah, that's just a funny order. Yeah, Nickelback. Okay, is it you, Jenny? Mm, Want to do one more each? Two is more it each? almost time to go? Is it almost time to end it? Kinda. Well, what are we at? How do you know? Like twenty-five. All right, we're chilling. Damn. For my next trick, I will pull blank out of blank. Oh. So for these ones, <clears throat> each player gives me two cards because there's two blanks. <laughs> I will pull blank out of the blank. Okay, top. Top's first. Top is first. Top's first. So, for my next trick, I will pull the ooze out of the American dream. (laughs) (laughs) Kind of random, but makes sense. For my next trick, I will pull repression out of nipple blades. (laughs) <laughs> nipple blades? Whatever <laughs> nipple blades are. <laughs> Perkies? <laughs> what you go with the nipple blades? Molly Perky said, hey. <laughs> nipple blades wins every time. Okay. Cheating? Just kidding. Yeah, you got some Perkies, Kitty. That's why. Alright, my turn. <clears throat> and, oh, man. You know what? I don't like the cards with names that I don't know. Mm-hmm. I want to relate. You know what I'm saying? Okay. <clears throat> Here we go. The Academy Award for blank goes to blank. <clears throat> oh, man. Oh, man, I'm man. having some fun. Oh, man. This is top first. Top first. Top first. Man, top we're first. nipple blading it up right now. Top real first. quick. Top first. All right. Here we go. And the Academy Award for the Chronic goes to Man Meat. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir, we're having fun. Okay. And the Academy Award for a fat bald man from the internet goes to William Shatner. <laughs> <laughs> man, oh, the chronic man meat. Yeah, you gotta go with the chronic man. That was the answer that made the most sense I've ever had in this game. Alright, um. Oh, Last one. one. Shatner's a yes. Last one, two more. We'll go uh, four more. All right. Let's I'm, do it. I'm judge, right? Yep. Yes, sir. I think there is actually. Dear Abby, I'm having some trouble with blank and would like your advice. Dear Abby. Mm. Ace. That was a Chicken Little reference for those of you who are staying with me, dear. Thank you. Chicken Abby. Little. Who doesn't get Chicken Little references? Dear Abby. Hmm. Dear Abby, I'm having some trouble with passing a kidney stone and would like your advice. That's rough. Times. Dear Abby, I'm having trouble with some estrogen and would like your advice. What's estrogen? It's that hormone that... Female testosterone. Oh. Well, makes one of the I think passing a kidney stone. Not worry about it. I think passing a kidney stone. Because I mean, you need advice on that. If you passing a kidney stone, yeah, cool. That's me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, JD, let's get it. Here we go. <clears throat> My last judge round. Yes. <clears throat> science will never explain blank. Oh, baby, I got it. What will it. science never explain? Chicken little references. Abby. Ace. Abby. Ace. Abby. Thank you. Science will never explain balls. Science will that. never explain take backsies. <laughs> Science will never explain take backsies ever. Oh, man. Ever. The most kid one out of this whole game. Yes, sir. All right, my turn. Seven, uh, this will be my last one, right? Yes. I'm going to get really deep. When I pooped, <laughs> what came out of my butt? <sighs> I'm excited, oh, baby. Man. Come on. Hit me with Am it. Am I sending it here? Am I send s- it till you can't send it anymore. Listen. I'm, I'm saying no, I'm not listening anymore. <clears throat> Listen up, people. I pee. When I pooped. I pooped. I pee. I pee and I pooped. And this one, I pooped. When I pooped, you want to know what came out of my butt? The South. 
movie. <laughs> oh. That's a good one. All right, yo. Just the south. This next has one. A this this next one better come out swinging. Here we go. IP. IP Nation. When I pooped, you want to know what came out of my butt? The Boy Scouts of America. <laughs> <laughs> Boy Scouts, man, that's good. Yeah. Oh my god. So was it Boy Scouts? Heck yeah. Who's that? Tells me. Oh, are you serious, dude? I, you had a good answer too, man. This is this isn't a good card. I'm gonna end it on the bang. Yeah, go ahead and end it. You guys want a two parter or one part? I'm cool. With, I like one parters. Okay. Do you, if you like two parters, we could go two. Whatever. <clears throat> the Smithsonian Museum of Natural History has just opened an interactive exhibit on blank. Uh, I'm gonna hit you a little bit. We'll see. <clears throat> oh man! Oh, you went through your whole deck. I'm only going four, baby. Uh, well, I mean, I'm just it's the last one. Yeah, you know. Yeah, mm. True. yeah. yeah. cheater. Mm. Mm. Okay, this one's kind of random. Where'd he go? <laughs> I could have went a lot of ways here. Okay. The Smithsonian Museum of Natural History has just opened an interactive exhibit on children of, on leashes. <laughs> interactive? The Smithsonian Museum of Natural History has just opened an interactive exhibit on pooping back and forth forever. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Children on leashes or pooping back and forth forever. See, like, I've seen children on leashes. I'm just Those little like buckles. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna say pooping. Yeah, I would have gone the same way. I say pooping. Pooping's always fun. That's really back and forth forever. All right, I think that uh that calls it for yeah. this podcast. Thank you for tuning in. I'm Thank sorry if we offended you. We didn't mean to. Yeah. It's all jokes. Thing. Nothing is personal here. We don't mean anything. The the cards have said. The mm-hmm. card said it. We did. Yeah. We just chose what the card said. Um. Oh. You, sorry. Go ahead. Go ahead. If you guys um. Have been here up to this part. I want you guys to comment um, cards against humanity in the comments. Drop a like if you guys enjoyed this. We'll do it again. We had a lot of fun with it. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. Mm -hmm. So, remember what we always say. Much love. Spread love. Stay safe. And put your kids on leashes. I'm just kidding. Don't Don't do that. Don't do that. We'll see you later. All right.